hey, so turbans this year. Do we love them? Do we hate them? I love them. It's such a good idea for, you know, when your hair is just way too frizzy, but you can kind of get the front maybe defined and you don't feel like going through the rest. So this is how I'm rocking mine today. And this is just a regular hair scarf. I'm going to attempt to recreate this look. They never come out the same twice in a row, though. So here we go. Okay. So big, huge afro. You know, I love it. But every now and then, you just want to switch it up. So my scarf is, it's got to be at least six feet long because it's taller than me. So that's how long my scarf is. But, you know, a five-foot scarf, depending on how long your hair is, too, you're going to need more or less material. Just kind of brush your hair to the front with your hands and then take the scarf and pull it up. This is so hard to explain and show, especially with this camera. All right. So then you take the front, start to make a bow, and make sure that this part comes down the middle. And just kind of tighten that up, bring it over your head, and bring this through. And then, you know, don't worry about it being perfect as you're doing it, because you can always go back. So then, you see how it looks really crazy right now, but we'll fix that. And what I like to do is wrap these, because otherwise, I look crazy. Wrap these, because otherwise they come out. Bring it around the back, back to the front. And if you can, tie it back up top. If you can't, just tuck it in. See, that's why I like to twirl it, because this comes out, but you could tuck that in, too. All right, so then I'll take these hairs on the side and tuck that into the turban, because I just want a poof out in the front, kind of like a bang. And then I leave all this out, so you could kind of leave that out, but I like it to look like it's all in one part, so I take that to make it more full and pin it up with a bobby pin. Now, since this part is huge and not in any kind of real shape, what I do is I take it and I pull it down into this front type part to make this big part kind of smaller. And that will do it. And like I said, it never really comes out the same twice, and especially because I'm doing this in my camera and not in a mirror. But this is the basic gist of it. Uh, let me know how you feel about turbans as a fashion statement for this summer. I really like it because it's kind of cultural. And I always kind of like things that bring culture into everyday life. You know, turbans are actually worn in a lot of other countries. It's just not the norm here. So I'm loving it for the summer. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you in another video.